All right, we are back. Guess who's back? Back again. <laughs> now, on to level three. So that's the deal with this level. That, of course, that blueprint gives off a hint. So you can see there's a sheep right next to a switch. And notice the hearts above his head and the hearts coming out of its eyes. <laughs> And of course, we obviously have to do that to clear this stage. Here we go. Ah, oh, this music. So good. I mean, this music is something you expect to hear out of a cartoon. I mean, of course, Looney Tunes are a cartoon. <laughs> Alright, to start off, what we gotta do here is bash this letterbox. Then those two crates will be on top of that seesaw. Now we have to head on over in that direction. Ah, oh, I messed up there with that run. No, I did not see those two crates. I saw those two crates on top of there. <laughs> so I gotta push this boulder off. So let the boulder take care of the rest. You know, I wonder how the term seesaw came about. It's like you take two words, uh, like take the word C, then you take the different different tense of the word C, which is saw, and then just put them together and become seesaw. <laughs> I wonder how those I wonder how that came about. So we got the rocket and the explosive. Now let's head on over to Robin Hood Daffy. Okay, time to learn something new. Bushes aren't the only thing that can help you hide. You can use rocks too. Look at the size of those rocks. Hey, if I were you, I'd hide behind them. Come close on one side of this rock, and press the stealth button to camouflage yourself. Tell you what, you can practice with me. Well, that makes sense, because Wily e. Coyote is brown and those rocks are brown. Of course he can camouflage behind them. Do you want to be trained by me? Who doesn't want to be trained by Daffy? Listen, I'll watch over the rocks while you hide yourself behind this one. After you cross the white line, I'll watch carefully to see if you can reach this square without me noticing you. It's up to you now. I just love those animations for Daffy. <laughs> They're pretty silly. So you just gotta hold the R1 button next to a rock to hide behind them. Just gotta wait till he gets the call. Okay, start when you want. Here we go. Almost messed up there because I just ran out there. I gotta wait until he turns his head. Could have had a good chance to get past him earlier, but that's okay. And I can just go right past him like this. And I can make it to the square with ease. Great! You're ready to take on the sheepdog! If you want some more advice, just come back to me. Of course we're gonna talk to him. I mean, of course we gotta get that extra dialogue. What do you want to talk about? Rocks, camera, and are you lost? Let's talk about rocks. You can hide behind rocks by keeping the stealth button pressed. <laughs> of course, that's all you had to say. Camera. You don't want to be in the dark, do ya? Or do ya? Well, if you want to see what's going on around you, use the L2 and R2 buttons. You can also use your objects. Or you can use the right analog stick, because this game is analog stick uh, compatible. <laughs> and are you lost? Pick up the object you want to store in your inventory. You can use it right away by keeping the inventory button pressed. A menu will appear with your objects. Use the right and left arrows to select the one you want, release the button, and it's yours. It's simple, Simon. Oh, Simon, huh? Well, Simon says I'm gonna take this dynamite and blow up Daffy Duck with it. I mean, who doesn't want to see Daffy Duck explode? Ha ha! What do you have to say about that now, Daffy? Ha ha, it is to laugh. 
There's nothing funny about blown up duck. By your laughter, I can tell that you disagree. Well, let's see if you think this is funny. I will stop you from playing for about one minute while you consider the error of your ways. Did we learn our lesson? Hmm? That little timeout should teach you to blow me up. But never say I hold a grudge. Back to the game! <laughs> that really was funny, Daffy. And that entire timeout, especially the pause, did not even last a minute. The pause lasts about maybe five seconds, while the entire time he was talking did not even last a minute. But hey, even if it all lasted a whole minute, it would still be funny. <laughs> oh man, gotta love it. Alright, so now we gotta do here is we gotta rock it to the other side. Let's rock it! So, we gotta head on over here, and look what we have. Some more lettuce. Five nice pieces of lettuce. Fresh made lettuce. Or fresh grown lettuce, I should say. <laughs> Alright. See, As you can see, all the sheep are in Sam's uh, uh, point of view. So what we got to do here is we got to make the sheep come to us. So I'm got to have a piece of lettuce in my hand. And you see that sheep that's closest to that farthest rock? That's the one we're going to have to get. So, we just got to work our way towards that rock with lettuce in hand, and we will get the sheep's attention. I could have made it right there, but I want to play it safe. Better safe than sorry, but I have a good chance right here. Come on, sheep, hurry up. I want to make it over. That's all right. I'm not even sure if the sheep will even try to eat the lettuce when it's in my hand. I gotta wait until he turns around and turns the other way. Alright, we're out of here. I'll just keep the sheep, uh, the lettuce in hand. Well, maybe not. So what I want to do is I want to put him down and have him step on that switch, which is what that blueprint showed at this, before the start of the level. Because sheep are curious. That's how I get up here. Bash this letter box. And yet another item will drop down. Get the elastic and jump on the seesaw to start your training. Well, it's the other way around. Start, I mean, jump on the seesaw, then get the elastic to start the training. <laughs> you know, that bullet didn't even go up very high, and it still took me up here. So now I got the elastic rubber band. By using the rubber band in this tree, you can open the gate. Don't forget that you can use certain objects while clinging to the elastic. So, this is our first use of the uh, elastic rubber band. Right here. By attaching just one end, you can take a flying leap and bounce back up. By tying it between two trees, it becomes a catapult. To take off, stretch the elastic and jump. So we gotta cling it to one end of the tree. And to get that sheep over to the switch, we have to use some of this lettuce. So we gotta drop down and put it down. And just to, make, just to make sure, let's have two pieces of lettuce. That should be good enough. Put the lettuce and the rubber band away. Then he should open the gate for us. And he does. Awesome. Find how to make this pile of rocks explode. But if you go down here, there's a pile of rocks. And how do we make them explode? Well, clean the elastic rubber band to the tree. Bring out the explosives. Put it on that wood. And gotta make sure that wood is raised up too. We gotta do it just in time. Alright, there we go. We did it. Just jump down there. Oh, come on. Jump on down there. Alright, awesome. That opens that. Okay, so now we can take the sheep. We gotta take him over to these two trees. Since we got two trees, we're going to have to put the rubber band and attach it to these two. So now it becomes a catapult. Uh, first, let's go and get that sheep to the other side. Alright, here we go. Fire! 
Oh, I forgot. I didn't release it. There we go. See, did he make it to the other side? Uh, yes, he did. Awesome. Now it's our turn. Yeah. Because I'm not going to complete the level just yet. So I gotta get that rocket again. If you remember that little uh, passage that we just unlocked? Now we just gotta head on that way. Let's rock it! Haha, <laughs> Sam, you can't get me! You can't get me! You can't catch me! You can't catch me! Na 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 na! You can't catch me! You can't catch me! Sucker! <laughs> Sucker! <laughs> Can you dig it? Sucker! <laughs> But over here is our time clock. Sweet. <laughs> and magic. The way out up here opens right in front of us. <laughs> and I want to take this lettuce for the heck of it. Gotta have a very good looking salad for today, folks. Alright. Just gotta head on back over here. And we're done. Well, not exactly. <laughs> but yeah. We're in the clear. That's how you do it. Such a sucker that Sam the Sheepdog is. He couldn't even catch us. You just gotta love messing with him. <laughs> Alrighty. There's yet another sheep. Nah. Thirteen to go. And yet another level is available for us. Because, of course, that's our next destination. <laughs> Fantastic! Oops. Our contestant needs quiet. Quiet!